Okay, so after replacing the window regulator in my 2000 Corvette yesterday, I want to find out what the root cause of the issue was. So, took out these screws here with my T wrench. Took out these little screws, just three of them here. There we go. And inside of here, we see that it connects with this half here, and that's all broken off. And that's supposed to be connected to this big wheel here. So that looks like it's a bit chewed up. Let's get that out of there. And this is not supposed to be all chewed up like that. That is supposed to be connected up here. So you can also see it's broken into pieces so it wasn't turning. <clears throat> the threads on the motor are able to turn this gear. See that's still tight but then this was not turning which in turn turns the wire cables to move the window up and down. So once again a piece of plastic specifically white nylon is the culprit here. The motor's probably still good, so I could probably save the motor, but I wish they would sell just this one piece. I could have replaced just this. Well, it goes into the other part of this, but a little rubber o-ring there. That is the problem. That is what broke. Anyway, I've got a new window regulator with motor in the car and hopefully the same thing doesn't happen again. It is a known issue with C5s, so when yours breaks, that's probably what broke. Bye.